OPML is an XML format for outlines. Originally developed by UserLand as a native file format for the Outliner application in its Radio UserLand product, it has since been adopted for other uses, the most common being to exchange lists of web feeds between web feed aggregators. The OPML specification defines an outline as a hierarchical, ordered list of arbitrary elements. The specification is fairly open which makes it suitable for many types of list data. Support for OPML is available in Mozilla Thunderbird, and many other RSS reader websites and applications can both import and export OPML files of subscriptions. XML Format The XML elements in an OPML document are This is the root element. It must contain the version attribute and one head and one body element. Contains metadata. May include any of these optional elements, title, date created, date modified, owner name, owner email, expansion state, vert scroll state, window top, window left, window bottom, window right. Each element is a simple text element. Date created and date modified contents conform to the date time format specified in RFC 822. Expansion state contains a comma separated list of line numbers that should be expanded on display. The window XXX elements define the position and size of the display window. An OPML processor may ignore all the head sub elements. If the outline is opened inside another outline, then the processor must ignore the window elements. Contains the content of the outline. Must have at least one outline element. Represents a line in the outline. May contain any number of arbitrary attributes. Common attributes include text and type. The outline element may contain any number of outline sub elements. Shortcomings The RFC 822 date format is considered obsolete, and amongst other things permits the representation of years as two digits. In general, date and time formats should be represented according to RFC 3339. Due to the semantics of the expansion state attribute, the expansion state of the children of collapse nodes cannot be stored. When an outline element is expanded, collapsed, added, deleted or moved, the expansion state of all elements below it must be recalculated. Due to the arbitrary nature of the type attribute, and the acceptance of arbitrary attributes on outline elements, Interoperability of OPML documents relies almost entirely on the undocumented conventions of content producers. MIME types aren't clear. Text XML usually merely identifies the document as having XML content, while Text XOPML does not specify that the document is XML since it lacks the plus XML suffix. Validation Dave Weiner has made a request for comments on a proposal for validating OPML and released a beta OPML validator. Katie Ginger from DLESE has published an XML schema document for validating OPML 2.0. There is also a DTD available for OPML 1.0. Example OPML documents, playlist, specification, presentation, directory. Alternative specifications, alternative specifications have been proposed, notably these include OML, XOXO and XBEL. See also, Data Portability, Dave Weiner, List of Content Syndication Markup Languages, XOXO a Euro Extensible Open XHTML Outlines, XBEL a Euro XML Bookmark Exchange Language, APML a Euro Attention Profiling Markup Language, Feed Icon. Share icon. References. External links. OPML 1.0 specification. OPML 2.0 specification. OPML editor app. OPML icon files. OPML viewer editor.